we are in this situation because of the lack of uh, maintaining our infrastructures by previous governments. Construction on the Louis Hippolyte La Fontaine Tunnel, which connects the island of Montreal to the South Shore, will be delayed until 2027. According to the Ministry of Transport and Sustainable Mobility, the $2.5 billion project will be postponed due to several factors, including mold. Transport Minister Geneviève Guilbeault says despite the delays, ensuring the safety of construction sites is key. First of all, the work is more complex than we expected in the two. Second, the uh, ventilation tours that we have to change. And third, labor shortage, so that we have sometimes uh, certain issues. And we had some issues regarding safety of the people who work on the site. The Louis Hippolyte La Fontaine tunnel restoration work began in 2019, and three of the tunnel's six lanes have been closed since 2022. The work was initially scheduled to end by fall 2025, but the opening of both tunnel tubes is now expected by fall 2026. Montrealers will see partial closures resulting from final completion work until 2027. We see it with the tunnel, but we also saw it with the Pont de l'Autourte. We saw it with the Pont de d'Orléans. We are in situations where we have to make urgent work that we cannot postpone because safety is at stake. At a press conference Monday, Minister Yilbo also announcing June 10th to 16th as a week in support of construction worker safety. For the first time, we will have this annual week Week dedicated to prevention and awareness about the safety of the people who work on our construction sites because it is a major issue year after year. There are too many people that are uh, hurt or even dead. Meanwhile, Montreal drivers hope the work on the Louis Hippolyte La Fontaine tunnel will lead to some light. I do 70,000 kilometers per year, and the goal is to avoid the tunnel and avoid Montreal as much as possible. It's always jammed. It's hell. Everyone is new and nothing against young people, but the older workers have left and taken their recipes with them. It's the citizens who pay. All the detours people do, they don't pay us back. Will they help with our gas? When I go to work, I have difficulty every morning, but I always say, better than it takes a little bit more time so it can be done properly. In Montreal, Anastasia Dextreen, City News.